Las Cruces man is facing possession of an explosive or incendiary device charges. This comes after he was found with pipe bomb parts in his backpack near a church in Las Cruces yesterday. This is a picture of that suspect, Nathan A. Wallace. ABC 7's Rosemary Montanez reports from our New Mexico mobile newsroom. This is a place where that man was found with pipe bomb parts in his backpack yesterday, just feet away from this church. Authorities are comparing this case to two bombings that happened back in 2015. Those cases are still not solved. Documents show a deputy found this man, 40 year old Nathan Wallace, around midnight Wednesday near East Mesa Baptist Church. They saw a syringe with a black substance on top of the playground, what they believed was heroin. The deputy also saw Wallace placing several different items into his backpack that included a gray eight inch long galvanized pipe. When he was asked what it was, he said, it's not drugs, it's gunpowder, end quote. Other items included a battery bridge, which is used for initiation, a rechargeable battery, and a motion sensor. A sergeant with the bomb team determined it was an explosive device. Wallace reportedly told authorities the items were randomly placed in his backpack. Back in 2015, a device detonated at Calvary Baptist Church and another detonated at Holy Cross Catholic Church only 20 minutes later. Neighbors swiftly reacted to this happening so close to their homes. I used to feel safer, but now it's kind of leery. Mm -hmm. oh, I feel kind of leery about the whole thing. <laughs> Wallace reportedly told authorities he came to this church to charge his laptop that was without electricity. Reporting in Las Cruces with our New Mexico mobile newsroom, Rosemary Montañez, ABC7. Wallace was released hours after his arrest on a personal recognizance bond.